If you're looking to buy some advanced GG, you could use my code WALLA for 10% off. Thank you. Hey, what's going on guys? Walla here. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Sweet Sorrow Auto Rifle. I've been putting this video off for a while now and that's because there's been a lot more interesting weapons, but this is actually surprisingly not too bad and the rolls on it are really nice too. There's a few special things about this auto rifle. One, which is pretty obvious, you could put enhanced traits on it. And two, is that it actually has 17 zoom instead of 16 on it, which actually isn't that big of a deal, but technically speaking, it has the most range out of any rapid fire auto that isn't sunset at the moment. Of course, it has an origin trait on it too, land tank, which isn't that great for PvP to be completely real with you, but it's not terrible. So this sits at around 27 to 28 range if you have a really good roll like mine. So I was actually pretty surprised at how good it performed. It was only really nice because I had the tap the trigger and perpetual motion both stacking together. If I did not have those, I think it'd be a lot harder to control the recoil and the stability, but it was very, very smooth to use. 100%. I was kind of comparing this thing to the Summoner, and while I still think the Summoner is for sure better since it is a 600 RPM, this was definitely really fun to use. Whether you guys should go ahead and craft one for yourself, I guess you'll have to watch the gameplay and find out. Please drop a like and a sub on the video. I am trying to hit 200k before the end of the year. Thank you. Oh my god. My guy had the nasty fusion rifle. I'm really surprised he didn't kill me. I obviously win that gunfight when I'm that close up. I think the Warlock will spawn right there. Well, it definitely wasn't a Warlock, but it was someone. We're going to reload with transversive steps. Some guy just got body shotted. Can I steal a kill? Only one. Fuck. Maybe I should have gone for the guy on the left first. This map should be good for me because it is a little more open. So that means hand cannons shouldn't be too much of a problem for me. And the range, as you can tell, actually isn't too, too terrible. The only reason why it's not too bad is because this has actually 17 zoom on it. How did he get in the corner? What the fuck? Why would he dash backwards? Dude, that guy was so snug in the corner right there. Oh, I should have gone left. I knew it. Good news is we could probably pull heavy ammo. And uh, maybe get another kill or two here. I don't see anyone. The guy in first place has an ace of spades. So it's probably one of these guys here. That guy's dead. Melee. He's dead. Next guy. That's probably a smoke bomb. But there is someone. I get it. I'm getting a ping far left side. Yeah, he's in a rift. I saw him. I did see him. He's getting shot by someone else now. Dead. I'm gonna dash across. And we are getting shot by another ace of spades. I'm going to try to put a rift up as soon as possible. Jump across. And somehow we're still alive. Not for too much longer, I don't think. Some guy was shooting me from all the way over here. I'm going to see if I can auto rifle him. Someone did spawn behind us too. We're going to sandwich quite a bit here. I'm going to try to crouch and just kind of play my life. Someone is behind us. We're going to slide this. Ace of Spades guy is dead too. This was a little ballsy to challenge, but since we got like a we really weird angle, I was pretty confident he would not be able to react. We're going to actually jump towards this guy. He put a rift up. Very awkward place to put a rift. We're going to go for the extra heavy ammo since we are using the sword really, really nicely this game. Someone's far left. He's one shot. I expect him to just run straight at me. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. That was lucky. Uh-oh. Okay, we dodged that really good. Get some, like, poopy rocket. Very nice shots. We're probably dead. What? How did he die? Okay. That was a good game. Except for that one hunter that was kind of throwing... Uh, can't really complain. The only thing we really got outgunned by was someone with Ace of Spades, but he did have the perk for one of them. So, you know, I, I think that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Listen, I know you're bored and you probably got nothing to do, so why not join the Discord? Discord.gg slash Walla. Okay, thank you. Bye. All right. He did not look up for some reason, which was strange. I thought maybe he would know, considering I'm on the radar. 
That guy was kind of hard to see. And he didn't even headshot me. He did so much damage right there. Still have a decent amount of time left on the float. We're going to turn around here. This guy should be weak enough to kill, even though I'm really far away. This thing has some very, very surprising range. Very nice shot with a bow. But you can't jump with the Lominar. Come on, man. We're doing pretty good so far. Some guy's actually tied with us, though, which is not good. Another guy using an auto rifle. Interesting. I've been running into a lot of strange weapons today. Auto rifles, sidearms, Vex Mytho class, bows. It's not necessarily all shotgun hand cannon, which is awesome. Don't get me wrong. I love it. it it's definitely a nice change of pace. Who am I even looking for here? The guy in second place is way too far from me. I feel like if I chase him, I might get caught off guard, but I'm going to have to actually do something. This is him, I think. He did have heavy ammo for me, which was nice. Thank you. As soon as I said we probably couldn't chase him, I end up chasing him and it works out in my favor, so I'm happy. We're going to have to get out quick because uh, we are going to get teamed. I thought maybe I'd be able to kill that grenade launcher guy. We're going to steer clear of this guy with the Vex Mytho class. I don't think we're going to beat him in a 1v1 situation. It's just not practical to outgun him. Here we go. I did hear a hunter jump. Is it the Vex guy pushing us? I do believe it is the Vex guy. You should be able to chase, I would say. You mother... What the fuck? That was so weird. Chaperone man's dead. What's going on this game? Where did everyone go? Did everyone leave? I don't think so. That was the bow guy right there. Oh my god. There we go. We hit some nice movement on the stairs right there to get close to him. Which was nice. He just went invis. He's probably far left side. No, he's behind that guy. He's weak. Melee him. Nice, dude. He's no shield now. You know what was crazy? That guy had chaperone, and I still managed to kill him somehow. I'm gonna break the shield. Very beautiful grenade launcher shot. You actually could not steal that one. Chaperone rolling up behind us. He is one shot. Here we go. I think this guy is actually invisible. Oh, never mind. No, he's not. I can't see the Vex guy. I do want to push him. But he's actually playing his life very, very well. Okay, very nice nade. You steal that. There we go. Vex guy got us one shot, but we're still okay. And we're also about to get Dawnblade pretty soon, too. So this is, this is good. We got smoke. I'm going to pop my Dawn. Should be able to get him. Perfect. We just need two more kills. The Titan should be up right now. Very random smoke bomb again. I keep getting randomly smoked out of nowhere. Just spawns. <laughs> Very slow Dawn Blade, but I still feel like we should be able to get a kill with it. There we go. Patience is key sometimes. Just need one more kill. Vex Mytho class has some very nice shots. He keeps free firing. We're going to swipe across. And just like that. Just like that, GG. <laughs> oh my god. That was such a good ending. Damn it, I don't know if I should use that game. I feel like I feel like it was a good game. But it was definitely a little slower. We only died one. You know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna throw it in there. It was a little different. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. That was pretty fun. I don't know if I'm going to go for this for myself personally, but if you guys do like rapid fire frame auto rifles, this is probably going to be better than the stasis one. I haven't done a video on the stasis one yet, but I probably will soon this week. And like always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.